Alright, welcome back to Taste Panel for Chili Nerds. This is our ninth edition, and today I do have another sauce. Melinda's Scotch Bonnet. Alright, this is such an attractive looking sauce. It grabbed my attention. Uh, it has a nice orangish yellow color, which is something new. We're used to some uh, red sauces recently. Um, Alright, what is this? Melinda's Original Habanero Pepper Sauce Scotch Bonnet Fiery Hot Pepper Sauce. Alright, we have a little uh, information on the side here. Naturally hot. Okay, Melinda is famous for its all-natural balance of heat and flavor. Our original Scotch Bonnet Pepper Sauce recipe blends this bold chili with fresh carrots, papaya, passion fruit, for a truly fiery, fruity experience. A complex West Indies that enhances the original flavor of your foods without overpowering. All right, we have all natural fresh ingredients, no artificial preservatives or colors, gluten-free, no GMOs. All right, now, uh, Melinda's is a product of Costa Rica. Alright, uh, there it covered some of the ingredients, but we'll, uh, we'll check out the ingredients here. Alright, uh, choice scotch bonnet peppers, fresh carrots as mentioned before, papayas, we have our exotic fruits there, salt, lime juice, acetic acid, onion, passion fruit juice, citric acid, garlic, and xanthan gum. All right, there we have it, Melinda's. Let's give this guy a roll. All right, trusty knife. Let's see if we can get this off of here. All right. Oh, I think that's gonna do it. Even if thorned and white, this one is white to our usual black. All right, here we have it, Melinda's. Give this a shake. And see plastic spill cap. If I can get that off of there. All right, there we go. Now, see what secret is in the nose. Hmm. Well, of course, we're getting the uh, habanero pepper aroma is very, very pungent in the in the, uh, the smell of this. Also, getting a kind of like a tangy vinegar aroma. Hmm. I think I'm even picking up, maybe picking up some of that papaya fruity smell too. Hmm. All right. Well, trusty spoon. Oh, here we go. Oh, wow, this looks nice. Oh, man. It's all chunky and full of body. Ah, it looks like there's some seeds. Wow, chunks of pepper. Ah, I'm having a habit of overflowing my spoon. All right, there we have it. Again, a nice uh, yellowish orange color. Wow, lots of. No. Lots of pepper pieces and uh, lots of seeds. So here we go. Mm. Mm. Mm, chunky. Mm. Lots of crunchy seeds. Mm. All right, getting, uh, getting, uh, I am getting that fruity sweetness up front. Uh, I'm not sure if that's from the, uh, from the, uh, peppers or if it's from the, uh, papaya, quite possibly both. Getting a little bit of a tang there from the vinegar. It has a definite vinegar flavor lingering. Um... Hotter than some, definitely got heat back of the throat area. Uh, 
definitely hit in the back of my throat, back of my tongue. Uh, getting a lip burn, bottom lip, going up my top lip. Um, I don't know, kind of covering my whole tongue. Actually, sides, front, back, feel it most in the back of my throat is just. Um, yeah, a lot of warmth coming right down. Um, burn still building on the tongue. Um, hey, the roof of my mouth even starting to come up in the back of the roof of my mouth. Yeah, fair degree of heat with this one. Yeah. Um, habanero flavor is just igniting the mouth, and the heat, and the flavor. Uh, the uh, initial fruitiness kind of subsided. Uh, I was almost right away and you tasted it, and it just peppers took over. It was a bang and heat. It's still building a little bit. I don't feel it. Oof. Some warmth going down. Um, yeah, very nice. Very nice heat. Not uh, Nothing overpowering, but uh, definitely present on this one. Yeah. Mm. So again, it's uh, sort of like last. We got a, a last edition. We got a, a pass sauce with a sweet up front and then uh, hits you... Uh, Hits you with some heat, but this one here is uh, a little hotter than uh, than the uh, the howl and holler that we had last time. Otherwise, uh, that sweet and the sweet and heat, uh, a factor of both of the sauces, is very similar. Um, this one here has a ah, packs a pretty good punch, very good sauce. All right, so when we're having hot sauce. Um, this is really precious liquid, this type of stuff. But there is even more precious liquid. The most precious liquid of all, blood of Jesus. Okay? You were bought with a price. Okay? That price was Jesus' blood when he went to the cross. And he died for you. And he died for me. And he died for everyone else. We were purchased. Okay? The only way sin can be forgiven is through the spilling of blood. And when God sent his son to die, that was the ultimate sacrifice and that was the end of sin. Okay, does that mean you're gonna sit, not going to sit anymore? Not true at all. Okay, does it mean that if you repent and put your faith in Christ and ask God for forgiveness of your sins that you'll be forgiven? Yes, it does. Okay, remember you were bought. Repent and remember, be of good joy because you are forgiven. All right, hey, I'm going to give this uh, 8 to 10 and... Uh, We'll be back with Melinda's Scotch Bonnet. Woo! We're uh, back with Melinda's Scotch Bonnet sauce. All right. So, uh, actually, I thought this one was kind of hot. I uh, still got a really good mouth burn. Whole chest is warm. Well, my sinus is going off. Um... When, uh, yeah, excuse me, um, I don't know, this is a uh, non-extract sauce, very, that's a lot of heat, I think, anyway, um, uh, the side I got it off of, it wasn't necessarily in their, uh, top heat factor, but, I don't know, I'm thinking that's one of the hotter ones we had in a while, so, uh, but big on flavor too, so uh, we have a we have the double-edged sword there, which is a, a positive actually. I, I would imagine uh, for most, we got a really good fruity habanero pepper flavor. Plus we get some other that tropical fruit flavor going on there. We have a good consistency with uh, crunchy seeds and pepper pulp, and uh, oh, we got that lovely color. You can see right there, and. Uh, Boy, and it's a firecracker too with the with the heat. So um, yeah, Melinda Scotch bonnet. You see the fun I'm having. Whew. Try this one at home. <laughs>